Welcome to this series of videos on SDG Indicator 651, Implementing Integrated Water Resources Management. These videos will provide an overview of the 2023 monitoring and reporting process. Welcome to part one, which will present some background information on integrated water resources management reporting in the context of the Sustainable Development Goals. The United Nations supports countries to monitor water and sanitation related issues within the framework of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development, or SDGs. This effort is coordinated by UN Water through the Integrated Monitoring Initiative for SDG 6, also known as IMI SDG 6. In total, 12 indicators contribute to reporting on the progress towards SDG 6, with various UN organizations acting as custodian agencies for each indicator. SDG 6 is to ensure availability and sustainable management of water and sanitation for all, but it covers much more than water supply and sanitation. The goal covers all aspects of water resources management and cuts across social, economic and environmental dimensions of sustainable development. Goal 6 is essential for meeting other goals, such as those on food and energy security and biodiversity. As you know, a key part of managing fresh water lies in understanding the different needs and roles of people who use that water, as well as the laws, institutions and governance mechanisms that are in place to manage it. These aspects are covered by the IWRM approach, which is the focus of Target 6.5. Target 6.5 is about implementing IWRM more than simply having a plan. So the stages of implementation across various aspects of IWRM must be monitored. Indicator 6.5.1 assesses that degree of IWRM implementation in each country. Indicator 6.5.2 specifically deals with transboundary cooperation. Data for 652 is collected in a separate process Though focal points from 651 and 652 should communicate with each other to harmonize reporting as far as possible. UNEP is the custodian agency for indicator 651. The SDG 651 reporting process is laid out in this infographic. The UN Environment Programme, as custodian of indicator 651, invites countries to undertake data collection. Each country then assigns a National SDG 651 Focal Point, or FP. These national focal points are responsible for coordinating a multi-stakeholder consultation process to ensure broad engagement to complete the survey. The stakeholders discuss the survey results and agree on the scores for example, in an in-person or online consultation. The SDG 651 Help Desk is available throughout the process to provide support to the focal points and undertake quality assurance of the draft survey results. The final SDG 651 National Report on the status of IWRM implementation in the country is published. The UN Statistics Division receives the results from UNEP. UNEP produces a global analysis and report and shares these on the IWRM data portal. And stakeholders can then use the data to prioritize key activities to improve implementation of IWRM. <laughs> 